Well, my friend, the time's come to make it official. It's time to become our guildmaster. Don't worry. I promise this will be short and sweet. If you'll just meet us in the center of this cistern room, we can begin. Wait until the ceremony is over, then we'll talk. I'm not getting any younger. Let's get the ceremony done with. What do you need? Okay, got it. Anything else? Not now, you idiot. We'll talk after this report. Look, I've never been good at these things, so I'm just gonna keep it short. Being Guildmaster means more than just getting a cut of all the loot. It's about being a leader and keeping this rabble in order. With that in mind, I propose that the position of Guildmaster should be yours. Delvin? Agreed. Thanks. Sure, why not? Carlia. Absolutely. Everyone is in agreement. So all I can do now is name you Guildmaster. And wish you good fortune and long life. Now everyone, get back to work. So, the ending of my tale I began early. Is this your tale? I can't think of a better person for the job, Nightingale. My favorite. We abetted four women on the same night. Well, if you don't want to hear it, that's your loss. If I wanted to hear a tall tale, I'd read a children's story line. Get some better story. You need anything, anything at all, don't hesitate to ask. Take a good look around you. Have you ever seen the guild in such a prosperous state? With Mercer Freygon and our influence spreading across Skyrim, the guild's earned a new level of respect it hasn't seen in decades. I couldn't be more proud to be part of the Thieves' Guild, or its new guildmaster. Well, that's it. Sorry if it isn't the ceremony you were hoping for, but we're not exactly known for throwing our coin around. After we're done, Head over to Tenelia, and she'll set you up with your Guildmaster armor. Oh, and one last thing. Here, I want you to take this. It's sort of a tradition around here. I suppose congratulations are in order. Now don't screw it up. <laughs>